Bikes for the, for the fifth graders moving on to middle school, doing big things, going to sixth grade. Uh, it's a special event provided by United Healthcare. Uh, they, they put it all together, did everything, and I'm just here to support and put some smiles on some kids' faces. What was that like when you saw them getting biked? You announced to them they were getting there. Yeah. You, were, you were a fifth grader once. What, yeah. what it would mean to get a bike? Oh, it was huge, yeah, especially going into the summer, kicking off the summer on, the, on, a, on a good note. Uh, spending time with my friends, uh, it would have been a blessing uh, to have a you know, group of people like United Healthcare to have a professional athlete provide bikes. Uh, so it's really special for these kids; they can have them going into the summer. You did good on those Hackett uh, flashcards last year. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The offensive plays. I take it you were a good student. I, I was. I was decent. <laughs> I was all right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's, it's a good event. Like I said, United Healthcare put it all together. So a big shout out to them and glad we could put smiles on kids' faces. What does it mean to you? Like, what does it feel like to you when you see them smile? What do you get from it personally? I, it gives me chills because, you know, I have a lot of nieces and nephews and just spending time with them uh, is, a, is a good feeling. So I know, you know, spending time with kids in a place like Denver, a great city, a lot of kids are in need. They, they look up to athletes like us. Uh, so it's a big deal and uh, really fun to be able to get out in the community and do the things that I've been wanting to do for a while to do more in the community, well, especially with kids. Let's talk uh, Broncos just briefly. What uh, how, Have things changed with Sean Payton? Yeah, uh, we're definitely grinding. Uh, we're just taking it one day at a time, not really talking, about, talking much about what we're doing. We're just going to uh, take it one day at a time, keep working, and, and show what we have in the fall. What do you know about him? Because you were at LSU. Mm -hmm. I mean, the Saints are huge there. What did you know about Sean, and what's your impression been of Coach Payton? Uh, I've been not knowing him, but seeing Sean Payton on TV all my, my whole life. You know, I grew up watching the Saints. Uh, they, Him and Drew Brees took over at a time where Louisiana was really in need, and they changed the culture and brought hope to the whole, not just New Orleans, but the whole city, I mean, the whole state of Louisiana. Uh, so. I knew he was a winner, and he's shown us that. He, he has a standard that he's expect from us, and we're just going to uh, just show, show it in, on, in the fall. Uh, not really talk about talk much about it, just show it. you got yeah. two new linemen, Ben Powers and Mike McGlinchey. What yeah. are your impressions of those two after being around him a little bit? Hard workers, hard workers, man. They grind every day in the weight room. We're pushing each other, getting better, and it's going to be fun working, working with those guys. And I think they're going to bring something special to our group. You said um, that you aren't talking a whole lot about it. That seems to be something that we in the media are finding out from Sean Payton. Yeah. He's not letting you guys talk too much. Yeah, what, what's the feeling about that? I love it. I mean, there's no point to really talk about what we're doing. The uh, only thing that matters is what we do on Sundays, Mondays, and sometimes Thursdays. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter you know, what, what we talk about in the offseason if we don't perform on, on in the fall. The, the schedule's out. Yeah. Everyone uh, get, always gets excited about the schedule. Yeah. <laughs> tell us, tell the Broncos country why you think we'll be better this year. Uh, I feel like we're just ready, we're just hungry. We've been, the organization's just been not in a good spot the past few years and feel like we're there. Every year we feel like we're there. Now it's just time to put it together.